Hi guys, so I thought I would um, put together this video quickly to show you how to find uh, copyright free videos on on YouTube and on on Google. So we'll start here with YouTube. So there's two real ways that I can go that I go about this. Um, first, you can you can just search directly in the search bar here. So let's just say, for instance, I want to find uh, some videos on let's just say um, let's say Java uh, data types. Okay. So if I search for Java data types, you will see up comes a whole list of them. But if I go into some of these, you'll find that most of them are not going to be, you will not be allowed to use them. So what you want to do is you are looking specifically for, well, to be completely safe, you are looking specifically for uh, videos that are marked as Creative Commons um, with reuse allowed. So what you can do is you can, after you've put your search in Java data types, you can just say co a comma and then just say uh, Creative Commons. You can just put it in as one word like that. Um, remember, YouTube is owned by Google, so the search is, is quite intelligent. So I'm going to go Java, Java data type, uh, comma, Creative Commons. Okay, so I get a couple of uh, results up here. So if I can see that, okay, the first one's in Tamil, uh, the next one is in Hindi, uh, the next one here is it's it's also in an Indian language and in Tamil, but here's one here that looks like it's in English. So I'm going to I'll just open this up. So I'm just going to open it up in a new tab. Here it is. Here, okay. I'm not going to really I'm not interested in watching it play. But what you what you do want to do is you want to go here to where it says show more. If you click on that, here is what you want. This is the most important thing here. So that license is Creative Commons Attribution a Reuse Allowed. So you are free to use the guy's entire video, or even parts of the video, um, but it's it's still good form to actually uh, give the guy attribution. So obviously, um, in, in whatever it is that you're making, you want to, you, you, you definitely want to cite the, the guy, the guy's video, you know, that just, that's just good manners as far as, far as I'm concerned. Okay, so there is there is another way we can do this. Um, Google on their on their page used to have a filter option. Okay, it's not really there anymore, but we can bring it up. So I'm going to go. I'm, I'm once again I'm on the home page. So I'm going to go uh, Java data types, um, and I'm just going to say comma filter. And when I click on that, you'll see I get this option that comes up here now. This filter option. So I can click on there. And I can now go and pick what do I want. So I can say, well, I'm looking for um, Creative Commons, right? So I'm going to click on Creative Commons, and it's going to redo my search using that as my filter. And let's go and pick one here. Um, let's say this top one. So I'll just open that. And I'm just going to stop it from running. And if I say show more here, and I come down its whole description once again here in the license you will see it says creative commons attribution reuse allowed okay that reuse allowed that is the keyword that is what you need okay as soon as it says reuse allowed then you can do anything you like with the video um, but like i said it's it would be good form just to cite the the url that you get this from okay so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to show you how to search um, on google let's say you want some images Okay, so what you're going to do is here on Google, I'm just going to come to images.google.com. Uh, that just takes me to the images section of, of Google. comes up here, and down here in the bottom right corner, you'll see there's settings. Okay, I'm right down in the bottom right corner where it says settings. I'm going to click on settings, and I'm going to go to advanced search. Okay, so let's say I want um, pictures of... Well, okay, let's just pick this one, information technology. So I'm going to put information technology, that's my keywords, okay? And now I'm going to come down here to where it says usage rights. It's not filtered by license at this point, but all I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the drop down here, and I'm going to go to um, free to use or share even commercially. Okay, so you can use or share even commercially, and if you want to be even more relaxed, you can say free to use, share, or modify 
even commercially. So this one here, you could obviously take the image and use it as is and do whatever you like with it. Um, this one here, you can take the image, um, you can share it and you can even change it. You can you can do something else to the image um, and use it commercially. So this here is by far um, the most loose of the, of the usage rights. So you just click on that and you say advanced search. Now, all of these, all of these images here, you'll see at the very top here, it says labeled for reuse with modification. So you could safely use any of these images that you see here on this page. Okay, so you would then just click on the image you want, go and track it down. And then however you do it, whether you download the image or whether you use the Windows snipping tool or whatever, it doesn't really matter. Um, you can grab the image for yourself. Once again, um, you can do anything you like with it, but it is good form. It's just good manners um, to cite the source.